Martin County Sheriff William D. Snyder said the person, suspected of pointing an AK-style rifle with a scope as Donald Trump was on the golf course, was apprehended within minutes of the FBI, Secret Service and Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office putting out a very urgent bolo, or be on the lookout, alert. The FBI says it's investigating what appears to be an attempted assassination of Donald Trump at his golf club in West Palm Beach, Florida. It comes just nine weeks after the Republican presidential nominee survived another such attempt. The former president was safe and unharmed after the U.S. Secret Service opened fire at the man who also had two backpacks hanging on a fence and a GoPro camera, and that he was about 400 yards to 500 yards away from Trump and hiding in shrubbery while the former president played golf on a nearby hole. The person dropped the weapon and fled in an SUV and was later taken into custody in the neighboring county. We have stopped the vehicle that the FBI, the Secret Service, and the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office asked all law enforcement to look for. We had the vehicle description, and we had a tag number. We, we mobilized out on the interstate. Two of my uh, marked units picked up the vehicle. We followed it for a bit. We were able to contain it using some of our bigger vehicles that we use for specialized stops. We got the vehicle stopped. Uh, since then, the FBI and the Secret Service have responded to the scene. Uh, it does appear that we, we, we certainly have the vehicle involved in the incident at Mar-a-Lago, and we have the suspect that they were looking for. And now the FBI and the Secret Service will take over that investigation. Well, we initially took him into custody and held him till the arrival of the federal authorities. The search of the vehicle, uh, looking for any weapons that may be in there, will now be up to the federal authorities and the uh, U.S. Attorney General. Well, I missed the stop. I was on the way from home, of course. Uh, it sounded very tense on the radio. We knew that we had a bolo, be on the lookout for somebody who had opened fire on the President of the United States. I would say there's probably not a more volatile, potentially dangerous situation than that. Our units were completely locked on. We were, we were ready to go. Had the vehicle fled, we would have stopped it. Uh, of course, God forbid, had there been a gunfight, we were ready to engage. Thankfully, because of good tactics, stopping the car, filming stop, getting him out of the vehicle, coming back to us, we were able to stabilize the scene without any further violence. It was just right after 2 o'clock this afternoon, following the bolo, the BM lookout that we received from south of us, that uh, our road units picked the vehicle up. And then uh, we waited a while. We didn't stop him right away. We didn't want a high-speed chase. So we were able to wait until we had adequate units, surrounded the vehicle and then forced it to a stop.